Mmm, smells great. What'd you make? I just liver with a side of fava beans and nice Chianti. You need to stop. What was that? Nothing. I asked you what you made. Not Michael's liver. <sighs> I'm sorry. No apology can excuse you. So, how are you and Michael? Great. We broke up yesterday. What? Yeah, he stayed at a friend's house until I can get all my stuff packed up, but it's no big deal. But, um, how are you? And don't give me the I'm great bullshit either. Excuse you, I'm fine. You look exhausted. I am. It was a long ride up here and I did not get much sleep. Aren't you still taking sleeping pills? Mm-mm. I quit those a while back now. Well, I have some if you need any. How did you get sleeping pills that strong? I know a guy. Carissa Merritt. Relax, relax. I'm just kidding. You left one of your bottles here the last time you came, and I kept it just in case, but I guess it's trash now. <sighs> I'm starving. Too bad. So, where are Mom and Dad? Oh, um, they're not coming. Why not? Long story. I've got time. Um, okay. I, uh, I never invited them. I guess it's not that long of a story after all. Krista, what is this about? Yeah, I'd like to know that myself. It's no big deal. I mean, with Michael gone and everything, it's just hard, and I don't want to be alone right now. Krista, you know you didn't need to make up some story to get us to come down here. We would have come regardless. I was actually wondering if I could go back down to your place just for a few days. Wait. So you made us drive all the way up here just to drive all the way back down to our house? Guess it does sound kind of silly when you say it out loud. Yeah, no shit. I wasn't talking to you. Hey, be nice to him. Why should I? Because he's your future brother-in-law? So is Josh. Just forget about him all of a sudden. Stop it!